Hello, hello. Welcome to the Deborah Berry channel. If this is your first time, I am Deborah Berry. This channel is all about fashion and styling and, and doing all we can do, ladies, to hold on to our pretty. <laughs> Everything we can possibly think of, you know. All the little things, all the big things, whatever it takes. And welcome back to my returning subscribers and viewers. Thank you, thank you, thank you for the love and support you show me each week. Love you, love you, love you. I am so happy you're here. And if you're new here, if you sit around and you like this, give it a thumbs up and subscribe and share it. All that good stuff. Now, as always, lipstick of the day. This week I put on uh, my old, one of my classics, Chanel Le Duo. I'm sure you've heard of that. I, I love these. That It's not transferring, non-transferring. And it goes on kind of tacky after it dries and you put this clear in on. It's a clear gloss. I don't know. I couldn't decide which color lipstick to put on. I was going back and forth. Uh, this color is called Bright Raspberry, number 104. And they have lots of colors. If you just don't have one of these in your lipstick collection, get a little duo. You'll love it, especially if you, especially under mask. And uh, if you're going to eat, it doesn't transfer, it's nice. And if you like a gloss, because it really glistens and gleams. And of course, moving right along on my nails, is Olive and June, of course. And this color is called Pen Pal. It's one I had in, in my collection already in my tools of Olive and June. And I, it's kind of new. Recently, I think I got it last year. But it's a good color. It's kind of a coral, pinky color. I was trying to find a lipstick to match it in my... I, nothing was working. But I wanted to let you know, if you don't want to go to the Olive and June site for the Olive and June products, Target does sell Olive and June. And I ordered some online yesterday. Or was that Saturday? I ordered some online Saturday. Uh, so I'll let you know when I get that in and see how that goes. Cause if you don't want to just go to the Olive and June site, Target has it. And I ordered, mostly I ordered the nail files, the buffers, the, the top coat. That top coat is the best top coat. If you don't even like the polish, you want to get a nice good top coat because it works well over all my other polishes. All, you know, the, I can't even think of the OPIs and all of that. It works well over the Revlon, the OPIs. Works really well over that. Now, ladies. We got that out the way. This week's topic is about, I decided I needed certain pieces to add to my wardrobe, but I was looking at the spring things that are out and I thought I need a few, I found a few spring staples that will carry me over into the summer. And you know, you, I want anything I buy now, you want to be able to wear it going forward. You don't want to just buy something. I can only wear it, what, how many more weeks left in this spring time? So I, I bought a couple of just classic, basic pieces. And of course, it's black, white, and tan. Because if you've got your other things in your summer wardrobe coming up, you know, you always want to add color. But sometimes you need just the staples, and I'm have to warn you, it's tan, it's black, it's white. <laughs> That's the way it goes in my life. But if you get those base pieces, you can build around. You can always add color to black. You can add color to white. You can add color to tan. You know, it's kind of like at doing your denim. You can never have too much denim, I, I think, in your wardrobe because you can mix so much with it. And uh, so I got those. I got uh, pieces from Banana and one piece from Chico. So, of course, Banana Republic. We know how that goes, right? But I, I, I remember I promised you last week to show you my new Tory Burch bag. Are you ready? Are you so ready? And it's an interesting bag. It's, let me get it for you. My husband bought it. Here she is. The color is called granola. Look at that. Look at, look at, look at, look at, look at that. She has feet and she has silver hardware. And it's, a lot of times it's hard to find a bag with silver hardware. But it's the perfect little size. Look at that. And she comes in white. She comes in black. Oh, 
and she's like 700 and some. I don't know if the price is on here. 748. <laughs> but let me show you something that I had to learn about this bag because when I looked at all the pictures online, the bag had this. This was what drew me to it. It's a classic bag, but the way it dipped in, I thought. Now I like that that shaping of it. You know, I really like that. But when I got mine, it was just straight and it double zips on top. Let me pull it open. And that's something I know. Well, I like that. Double zips on top. But if I can show you the inside, if you can see that inside, there's a little chain thing here. I thought that was for <laughs> put your keys. And then it dawned on me what it was for. So let me unhook it to show you what happens. If I can get it unhooked. Oh. Okay. With it unhooked, this is how the purse looked when my husband brought it to me. Like a regular straight bag. It had no dip. It's gone, you know. But that's how they show it online with it dipped in. And I kept saying, well, what's wrong with my bag? It's just straight. And you have to dip. Let's see. Take some of this inside out to show you. Of course, you get your dust bag in here. And there's a, a crossbody strap. I hadn't even messed with that. I should do that while I have you here, right? Crossbody strap. Let me cut the... Find some scissors here. How you been, ladies? Spring is springing up, isn't it? In most places, some places, there's lots of storms, right? We're just going to put the crossbody on while I'm talking to you, if I know where it goes. <laughs> oh, I'm not sure where it goes. I'll have to study up. I guess it can go... I'll have to look up how to put this crossbody on because I really don't know. There are no side loops. There are some inside hooks. Uh, but I think that's for the, um, to make it get that shape. But let me show you the inside. It's really ample size. It has a zipper. I am flubbing this, right? It has a zipper inside. And nice flat bottom. You get lots of stuff in it. But let me show you how you do this little part. This is when I first looked at it, I go, oh, that's so cool. It's got a thing in here to put your keys on. I don't know what I was thinking. But then it dawned on me when I saw the two little, if you can see those over here and over there, that's how you make it get that cinch look. But I'm telling you, I'm going to have to figure out how to uh, put the crossbody strap on. I could see where it could go inside here, but then you can't zip it. I remember when I bought another bag from um, Tori Birch and she says, let me show you how how to use the purse. And I said, I don't know how to use the purse. And it was something I had to do. So even if I have to go to the store, I'll figure it out. I love this without the crossbody though. It's a great bag. So great. And I guess once you let it sit like that a while, it that makes the shape for you that gives it because it looks like it's permanent in there like that now I love it we'll try to feature it today without the crossbody strap right <laughs> I can't believe I got a bag and I don't know how to put the crossbody you know unless I am not going to sit here and pretend I know how to do the crossbody but I love the bag I love the bag zip zip and I think maybe that was for to get the shape because now it's got the little shaping it needs. So what I'll do, I'll store it like that so that it can can get its little shape because one goes this way and one goes that way. I like it. My husband loved it. so And I love it a whole lot because he loved it enough for me. <laughs> so that's Tori Birch. Um, I didn't even tell you what it's called, right? It is called the satchel, the polished swing satchel. It's called the swing satchel. The white one is really pretty. 
Now, something else I was going to talk to you about and show you. Oh, remember I was telling you I needed some white pumps. I was looking for some white pumps. Well, I ordered, some, I think I told you I ordered some and it came and I, I had a beautiful pair by, um, I think it's Vince Camuto. But they were too big. I had to send them back to get an eight. So we'll see how those look and I'll show you those when they come. And they're just a classic white pump, pointed toe, you know, not too tall of a heel. I think they'll work. The eight and a half was too big. You know how you take a chance when you order online. But I want to show you this other pair of shoes that I'm going to feature in today's video. I found this pair by INC. I never have had any. INC shoes from Macy's. I've had INC clothing, but never shoes. But look at these. Look at them, ladies. Is that not adorable? It's like a take on the Valentino stud shoes, but it's all, you know, plastic and leather or whatever. It zips up the back. Nice size heel. Love this rubber, rubberized sole. Can you remember, ladies? And I know you're my if you're my age, you shoes you used to always have this slick leather bottom where if you weren't careful you could slide on your you know what out, on certain flooring and outside you used to go out on the concrete and kind of scuff up the bottom so it wouldn't be so slippery. And I am so impressed that they're putting this kind of sole on the shoes now because that used to be like an accident waiting to happen. But these these are eight and a half. I probably could have gotten an eight, but the eight and a half is working pretty good. So they run pretty true to size if you want to try them. They come in a, a tan color and one other color I can't remember. I don't remember. I wish they came in black. They didn't have black, but cute little shoe. I will list them below and they're not real expensive. Get them now, you know, I can get your white shoes before, you know, when it gets dead in the summer, they'll probably go up on white shoes. but. You're going to see those later in the video. Oh, I love those. So, all in all, we're going to do a few looks. I'll show you the key pieces I bought and a way to style them. And, uh, and just, you know, as we do. My fashion, my style, my age, my choice. And just to inspire you to continue. And, and I'm still trying to work within the closet budget. I'm not trying to go out and buy a bunch of stuff. Oh, I would love to. Just little pieces here and there. Because if you've got that base wardrobe, that's all you have to do is add a little piece here and there and get going. So, ladies, we're going to get right started right now. Look number one. Let's keep it casual and comfortable and cool and classic. Classic. The look, the piece that I am featuring in this look is this Banana Republic khaki a-line skirt with pockets. Look at that, ladies. It's a good little skirt to add to your wardrobe. I wish it was longer. It didn't come in a tall because it's from Banana Republic Factory. And sometimes you can get a tall, sometimes you can't. Because I would love it to be a couple of more inches longer. But I just put the tennis on with it. Just to make a casual look. Grab Tori. Good afternoon for shopping or meet the girls to hang out or you know, just hanging out with your husband even. <laughs> or with your dear sweet sister, which, which is always fun to do. These are some Amazon shades that I had for a while. Nice, good, clear amber tone. An old Ralph Lauren vest that, that I have really had. Love this little vest. And the, of course, the Banana Republic, you know, boat neck top. Can't get. I need to get me a couple of more of these because I know I'm going to wear them. But the skirt is really nice. It's, it's lightweight, and I love that that has this big hem in the bottom. That gives it a weight to the bottom of the skirt to help it to fall, fall nicely, you know. And I think it just works well with the tennis. You know, I'm always going to do a casual look for you. So there it is. And these are the Kohlheim tennis shoes that I showed you. I got them in gold and I have them in this color. And I love these just for, you know, scooting around, I'm trying to look cute even because they're a great tennis shoe. 
that completes this look. And I want to show you, I could have dressed this look up a bit. I'm going to try something with you while I have you here. This shoe. This is an old shoe of mine. It's the Anne Klein sandal. So I'm going to try this on with this skirt to dress it up a little bit. So give me a minute. Let me put them on for you. Oh, now, tell me what you think. The shoes work, right? The shoes work, but the vest doesn't work. So we have to take this off. Take the vest off. You know, I could put a belt on, put a belt on and change it around, but just to show you how versatile this top is, because I need to tuck it some more, but the skirt has pockets and you know we love pockets. We love pockets, don't we ladies? We all love pockets. Pockets are the thing. And I can still do my shades and do my bag. Even though it's a it's a little it's a little you know I can take it a little further, dress you up a little bit, change I could change the jewelry and all of that, just to have a different look. But I think this would work really well. I think you would like it. I think it's great. I got a size six. I almost wish I had gotten an eight, because right here it kind of rises up on me, you know. And this is my waist is small. I would have gotten an 8, it would have fit down, but I like, you know, where it's falling right here as far as fit. And, and I could go with that length. And I, just so you'll know, if these little legs look orange to you, I put some self-tanning something on there today, because sister needs some color, okay? <laughs> and so, they may look a little orange, but maybe they look that way because nothing's tanned right now. But. I just wanted to share that little duo with you and you can change your look just by changing the shoes and, and I could have changed the jewelry or so, but it's a skirt that could be casual. It's a skirt that could be a little dressier. You can go to the office if you're still working. You can go to church on Sunday. So, now we're gonna switch to something do our black and whites now. I think I'll do the black and white looks for you. Because I've got a black dress and I've got a black skirt. But I wanted to do, how many times have I said but? I apologize. I wanted to do this, this tan casual look for you first. It would have been nice. They should make this in white and make it in, in a black also. Be a nice little hint, hint, Banana Republic. So I'll be right back, ladies, with the next look for you. <laughs> Little black, white, and red. I just want you to look at this dress, ladies. <laughs> I put the red purse with it. The red shades. They're Amazon. I had them, you know, they came with that other pair. My Michael Kors red bag. The shoes, the shoes. Check out the shoes. Are they not gorgeous? Wait, I'm seeing lint on this black. Let me get that for you. Okay, let's do this over again. Let me put the purse down. Okay, now, here's the dress. With the shoes, I want you to just look at the shoes. Look at them. Are they not gorgeous? They are gorgeous. And this is a dress with pockets. I, I had a nut dress last year similar to this. I meant to bring it to show you. I'll get it for you. But let me show you this dress. I've got to get it in a smaller size. My boobs are not big enough. <laughs> this is a six. I need a four. Let me show you. Look at all the space back here. I need a four so that that will hold and that will hold. But I wanted to show you this dress so much because it's just a fun dress. And if you watch Lisa Lisa D1, she talked about this dress on her, 
in one of her videos and she had it in white and she said it was just so much dress that she said no she told her daughter Brooke we gotta take this one back and she found a more slenderizing you know white dress it does come in white but I love the volume of it I love it I love it I love it and you know I wear it with this is a mesh top I ordered from Amazon I ordered a black one and a white one ladies get you one of these we don't want your arms the arms aren't perfect or you want a little bit on your arms this is a perfect perfect little top I'll list them below really you know <clears throat> but again you can see this is too big right here but it's got that double hem that I love like that was in the skirt but look at that it's like a four inch hem and I got this in a tall so it's nice and long nice and long I mean look at that look at that and it's got pockets 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 I'm going to show you the one from last year that's from H&M that's similar to this I'll put a picture up showing you how I wore it with the little black and white striped top it's cute but it's uh it's the, the fabric is not as heavy and and it's uh it's a high low it's kind of longer in the back than in the front and it's got all these little skinny straps that you drawstring and it's cute it's very cute but it doesn't have pockets it doesn't have pockets it doesn't have a lining this one has a lining this one has a lining see there's a lining under here everything just lovely lovely so i wanted you to see this even though it's too big <laughs> look at this this is beautiful even with a push-up bra or whatever it's just pitiful in the straps so i'm going to go online and see if i can get another if i can get a four tall because i want the tall i mean when you're five eight you want it to come to your ankles this is how you want it to to fall you don't want it all up there i want it long so hopefully i'll be able to get one if not i'll have to try to see if the tailor can do something with this because it is too big but I just love it and I wanted you to see it. I wanted to share it with you to um, let you know, you know, get the white one. It'd be a beautiful white dress. Imagine it. So I tried the black mesh top on under here. It didn't just look like a lot of black. This white really stands out. Imagine maybe take the, the white dress and put the black mesh top. I don't know how that would look either, but get you a mesh top this is so nice I mean once it gets real hot it won't be but if you got to go somewhere you know there's going to be an air condition and you want to put a sundress on but you know and this is my answer to all those sundresses to put a little t-shirt under them create your own look create your own style create your own little fashion so I'm going to do another black and white look for you next, but I wanted to really share this dress with you because you know we love pockets, ladies. How much do we love pockets? Give us some pockets and we're happy. It could be the simplest little thing, but it's just something about the pockets. And now they're putting pockets in formal wear, big formal, formal skirts and voluminous dresses, pockets. Because sometimes you, you just want to put something in your pockets. You need just a little something. So I'm, People like to, I don't like to put anything in my pockets, but my hands. <laughs> but ladies, look at that. I know, I said but again, didn't I? It's all right, it's real life. I guess I might say that, I must say that in real life. I, I don't know. But again, check it out, ladies. I will list this dress, you know, they've got a sale right now. Get it, style it, wear it. Again, we can be twins, 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 but the shoes, you know you need to get these shoes. And I'm going to keep these shoes on for the next few looks. I got two more looks. I'm going to do these shoes because, uh, <laughs> love the shoes. Be right back. As the old song goes, let's make one more stop along the way. Hey, stop. Look at me. <laughs> it's black and white, ladies black and white look at this i just put on some dark shades some more amazon shades 
pulled out my black and white Eric Javits, my favorite bag in the whole wide world. Look at this bag. Look at it. Look at it. And this is a Banana Republic blouse. This is the Chico's long black slim skirt I was talking about. It is the perfect skirt for the summer. It has a little bit of stretch in it. has no splits. I get sick of splits up to here, splits over here. I just want it to fall. And it has pockets. It has pockets. It has pockets. Of course, it's Tory Burch belt. But I mean, look at this with this blouse. This is a big, loose blouse. But I thought this look was comfortable and cute and casual, however you want to put it. Take you a lot of places. And the skirt. Of course, the belt. I need one more hole. I've got it all the way over. My waist is small. But it could be a little tighter. But it works with this. And I'm saying butt again. Ah! Anyway, my other word I used to say a lot. Anyway, but this is a great look, comfortable look. And I love that it has the pockets. It has no waistband. I got it, I sized up on it. Because I don't like anything. I wasn't sure how Chico's ran, you know, and so I sized up because I hate a tight skirt that pulls across here. So I have no pulling. I think I got it in an eight, and I usually wear a six. But I've learned with straight things to get an eight because of my well, hips over here. But again, this is a cool look, comfortable, classic. <laughs> Did you see the shoes? The shoes are still working. The shoes still work with this. I mean, these shoes, ladies, you don't have to order these shoes. And they are comfortable. I am comfortable in them. And they feel good. And I think you would love this look. The skirt, look at that. I said, I think you would love this look. I meant the shoes. I don't know if you love this look. This may not even be you, but it's me. My fashion, my style, my age. We got one more look coming up. I appreciate you spending this time with me. I'm here every Thursday, every Thursday. And you know, give it a thumbs up, comment. You know, which one did you like the best? What do you think of that black dress? You know, should I just take it back and not worry about it? You know, I, I don't like to get caught up in things, but is it out of my age group? Because I don't think that you make stuff work for you in your age group. You wear it for your age group. So putting the top under it tones it down. You know, I, I could wear a sundress. If I'm on the beach or someplace on vacation, I'd put a sundress on. But other than that, get some extra wear out of your clothes. Put a little t-shirt or a mesh top under it and wear it to lunch. But I, I said but, didn't I? I love this bag. I love this look. I'm going to come back with the final look. <laughs> it's going to be nice. And it's Banana Republic. I'll let you know. It's from Banana Republic. It's a, a white skirt that I'm going to style for you. And I'm going to keep these shoes on because I love these shoes. I love these shoes. And when I get the white pumps in, I'll, I'll show those to you. Because I could easily wear the white pumps with, with this too. When I want to keep it up. Close. But these are nice. Nice, nice, nice. So, I'll be right back with the final look. I thank you for spending time with me, as always. Thank you, thank you, thank you. <laughs> like I say, there's always a finale, right? <laughs> White skirt, Tory bag, denim shirt, Panama hat. Diff shades. <laughs> and the white shoes. And the white shoes. Don't forget the white shoes, ladies. Don't forget the white shoes. I just thought I'd make this more of an eclectic look here. The bag. It still has the tag on it, of course. The bag. I think it works. Even though it's silver and I got all this gold, I don't have a problem mixing metals. You know, let's mix the metals because. Otherwise, you'll become a slave to them. You'll be like, I wouldn't wear that. I can't, you know, wear it. And again, 
This is the Banana Republic skirt that's like that dress. Again, I should have gotten a four. I have a safety pin right here to cinch the waist in. But, get the skirts up. There you go. Again, this skirt is lovely. The poplin cotton, and it has a lining. To get you a white skirt with a lining, that's a plus. It has that big wide hem. It has that nice pockets. Just a good classic white skirt because there are times in the summer that calls for a nice white skirt. You don't have anything else to put on. You grab that white skirt, put a little tank top on, a nice belt and jewelry, and out the door. You're classic, simple, and you're pretty. And I just put the Tory Burch belt on to kind of pick up this bag to uh, carry it together. You know, even though this seems more like a fall, I guess it's a spring bag, but. It could work. It could certainly work. Look at the little tag just wants to, I need to take that off. I'll do it later. But just think, look at that. She's out there. She's waiting on her table to be ready. She is dressed. She is like, ooh, look at her. And I love this blouse I got a couple of summers ago from Macy's. It's an ink, INC, INC shoes, INC blouse. But it's got the ruching. I could push it up. It's got the ruching here, which is kind of nice, right, ladies? Kind of nice for us. And it's just a nice little, nice little book. So, I hope you enjoyed this week. I had fun. It was a little bit of an effort for me because nothing was fitting exactly. Well, those this and the other thing didn't fit exactly. But I, I still wanted to show them to you. I wanted to show you those styles because it may work great for you. And you know, everything is for everybody, but some things are for a lot of people. <laughs> and this hat, my husband gave it to me. He actually gave it to me. Can you believe that? He gave me two of them. Because I was he's got a new one I want so bad, but he didn't give me that one. I may try to sneak it, but he did give me this though. He bought this for me. Thank you, honey. So I just want to say, until next week, leave a little kindness everywhere you go. Share, 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 and spread the love. Take care of yourself and each other, as Brian, oh, who is it? Lester says, take care of yourself and each other. That's so important. And I will see you next week, ladies, and we will do some more things. I have something I ordered coming in that I want to style around one piece. Can you believe that? you know I do it. You know I will do it and I will use these base pieces. And you're going to see these again on through the summer because I don't want to buy something and you see it and that's it. If you pick up these pieces, I want you to style them many, many ways. Get many, many wares out of them. Cost per wear. Get your, your money's worth and, and then you don't have to think about it. You put that on, put that on. Add a little t-shirt, add some jewelry. Bam, your classic simple and pretty. So again, I got way late, didn't I? I'll see you next week. We'll have some more fun.